Hi there. My name is Anthony Strager. Anthony 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 Strager. 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 Anthony Strager. I'm a British Berlin-based actor and a voiceover artist. I'm a British actor. I live here in Berlin. Casting is changing, and more and more these days, actors need to and have to do online or what is called e-casting. But why? Because it can be easier and more effective for production companies, especially when they're casting small roles for films and TV. And let's not forget, it takes the numbers pain out of the commercial casting game. It's also convenient for actors because you don't have to travel for hours to get there and back to the casting. You don't have to wait around when it's running late or make small talk with someone you don't know and probably can't be bothered with. No, you get to cozy up with your laptop, you get to fill in the online forms, you read the brief, then you need an iPhone, iPad, some form of camera to shoot it, and Bob's your uncle, fan is your aunt. As well as introduce yourself, you get the chance to show you have eight fingers and two thumbs. You get to do the obligatory profile shots. And then, you get to walk around in circles, and from side to side, to prove you're alive, can take direction and have all the bodily bits to do the job. Nice. You get asked to do some weird and wonderful things in e-castings, so I put a few clips together for you. I hope you like them. Welcome to Gothenburg. Welcome to Neolivi. Welcome to the final. And who will be European champions? The world champions, Germany? Or the biggest surprise of the tournament, Denmark? The peculiar fairy tale team that hasn't even qualified for the tournament. Good news. The speed limit says. Yeehaw! A certain fragrance has a certain personality, don't you think? And with a new supermarket planning to, you get the best deals ever. So that you really can have a super holiday. Ah, gracias. I don't care if the man invented moonbeams and pizza pie. He's a commie lover and an apologist for the Rosenbergs. And here it is, in his own hand, trying to influence a federal judge on behalf of the spies and pinko subversives. Who delivered our closely guarded atomic secrets right up to the steps of the Kremlin? This so-called genius would replace the stars and stripes with a hammer and sickle without breaking a sweat. <sighs> Fly me to the moon. Oh baby, fly me to the moon. <coughs> Fuck! Well, maybe if I can't piss on you, I can shit on you. Open your mouth, Nazi boy. That's me in a short roundup. Um, I hope this helps, and I hope to see you guys on set. Take care. Good luck with the production. Yeah.